Hi everyone. Let's solve question number thirty-one. If i equals to integral pi by six to pi by three dx upon under root cos x plus under root sine x, then we have to find out the value of this one. So this is again a very standard problem. We know that the limit, the summation of limits is pi by two, and the denominator is quite favorable. So basically, if I apply f of a plus b minus x property, then denominator won't change, and also we'll have a difference in the numerator. We'll get a minus pi by two minus x over here. So let's use that property. Let's call this as i dash. Right. So i dash would be pi by six to pi by three x dx upon this is pi by three. The root c plus and root s, right? And also i dash equals to pi by six, pi by three, f of a plus b minus x. So we'll be getting pi by two minus x dx divided by. If I write pi by two by under root cos of pi by two minus x plus under root sine of pi by two minus x. Eventually, I'll be getting again under root sine x plus under root cos x only. So denominator stays the same. So that would give me under root c plus under root s only. So if I add both of them, I'll be getting two i dash equals to pi by six to pi by three, and this pi this minus x and x gets cancelled out. We'll be getting pi by two in the numerator divided by under root c plus under root s dx. So this would become 2i dash equals to pi by 2 times. So this would become i only. This is given as i pi by 2i. So i dash would become pi i by 4. So c is the correct answer.